Hey, what's up, guys? Today I'll be teaching you how to play Backyard Baseball 2003 on your iPhone or iPad. Today I'm using my Windows computer, but if you follow along, this will work on a Mac as well. So, let's get to it. First thing you'll need to do is head over to your web browser. I'm using Google Chrome for this video. And we need to download the Backyard Baseball file, and we'll do that at myabandonware.com. Once you're at the site, there'll be a search bar at the top right. And we'll just click there, and we need to search Backyard Baseball in that search bar. On the next screen, scroll up a bit, and you'll see Backyard Baseball 2003 here. Select that one. Scroll up a bit and you'll see this yellow download. Click that one and then just another loose rectangle. Press download. It's a bit of a bigger file, so it'll take a few minutes. Pause if you need to. And once that's done, you can minimize that tab and we'll need to go to File Explorer. And when you open that, you'll need to navigate to the Downloads tab. And there you'll see the Backyard Baseball folder. You'll double-click to open that. And double-click again on this disk file. It'll take a second to open. You'll get this screen here. Just press Open. And you'll see these files here. Um, the game is in this folder here. So open up this game folder. And there will be around 30 files in it. But there will only be a few that we'll need to play the backyard baseball game. So now what we'll need to do is make a folder on the desktop. You'll do that by right and left click. Or double click on the Mac. New and go to new folder. And let's title that. Backyard Baseball 2003, like so. And we'll need to add these seven files to this Backyard Baseball folder. And you'll do that by holding down Control and select all of these files, A, B, 0, 2, 3, 4, and 9. And drag and drop those into that desktop Backyard Baseball folder. Okay, once you've done that, if you open it, you should see these seven files in there. Okay, now we need to open back up Google Chrome. And I'll be using Google Drive to transfer this folder to your to my iPhone or iPad. So once you're on Google, you need to navigate to Google Drive. If you don't have a Google email, it's really quick and easy to make one. Once so you're just sign in to your Google Drive. And once you're on the screen at the top left, you'll see a new button. Select that and select folder upload. Okay, select desktop, and then you go to the Backyard Baseball 2003 folder, and select that one. And yes, you want to select upload there. It'll take a couple minutes. Once that's finished, you're now done with your computer, and you need to navigate over to your iPhone or iPad, and over to the App Store. Now we need to download the Scum VM app. So search that. You'll see Scum VM is brown square with the green S. Download that. Okay, once it's finished and you open it, it'll look something like 
Like this. And this is where you add the baseball folder to run the game. And if you go to the File Explorer app and navigate to all my iPad on the locations, you'll see it gave you a scum VM folder. And this is where the baseball folder will be saved. Okay, and now you can close it out, and now we need to go back to the App Store and download Google Drive. Okay, once that's finished, if you go back to the Files app, you will now see that on the locations you have a Google Drive icon here. If you select that, you'll see Open Drive there in blue. Select that and we'll open Google Drive from there. And here, just sign in. And at the bottom right, you'll see a Files tab. You need to select Files and you'll see that Backyard Baseball 2003 folder that we saved earlier. And it should have those seven files inside. And when you close that, those files will automatically go into this backyard, into this, sorry, this drive folder here. And it should say Backyard Baseball 2003. So now we need to go to on my iPad into that scum VM folder from earlier. And inside of it, we'll need to make a new folder and title it. BYB 2003, because you'll need to drag and drop those files from the earlier folder into this folder for the game to run. So once you make that folder, navigate back to the Google Drive, hit select, and then you'll, we'll, you will select all of these files like such. And at the bottom, you'll see move, you'll select move, and it will navigate to on my iPad. Scum VM folder. Our Backyard Baseball 2003, our new folder. Open that. And on there, we'll just press copy there in the top right. And all of those files will copy into that folder for you. Okay, and once that's done, you can double check again. Go to on my iPad, Scum VM, and double check to see if those Seven files are in your backyard baseball folder, and they should be. So now we can close this out, and we'll need to navigate back over to Scum VM app. And from there, you'll see on the right hand side, you'll see Add Game tab. Select Add Game, and you'll see Backyard Baseball 2003 at the top. Select that one, and select Choose on this screen. Just press OK. And now our game is ready. So you just hit start on the right hand side. You'll see an error message. Just click through that, the game will run perfectly. And what I like to do is I like to rotate my screen to get this mode here and then you'll have be able to press escape and skip through some of these cutscenes. But we'll just start up a game really quickly to show you that it's working. I don't have any sound because I'm obviously screen recording on my iPad, but you'll have sound once you begin playing. Let's just show you a bit of gameplay. Oh, we got Randy Johnson on the mound. Let's see if we can get on base here. Oh, it actually might work. Get a little butt there. And we're safe. Okay. Let's so get started to the game there. What? Yeah, there you go. That's how you play um, Backyard Baseball 2003 on your iPhone or iPad. Please let me know in the comments if you have any questions or trouble, or if you need me to slow it down a little bit. But all the steps are here. Pause if you need to. And enjoy. Thank you.